If you're asked to simplify the fraction 8 25ths, here's how you do it. We're trying to find another fraction that is equivalent, has the same value as 8 over 25. It's just that we've reduced it or simplified it to its lowest terms. So in the case of 8 and 25, we want to find a common factor, the greatest common factor. That's a whole number that goes into both 8 and 25. The problem is there isn't a whole number factor that goes into both 8 and 25 other than 1. And that means that the fraction 8 25ths, it's already simplified. If we look at the factors for both 8 and 25, they look like this. So you can see the factors for 8 and 25. The only thing that's in common is 1. So you divide 8 by 1, you get 8. 25, you divide that by 1, you get 25. 8 25ths, that's what we started with. So the fraction 8 25ths, it's already simplified. This is Dr. V. Thanks for watching.